Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is uh, Tuesday, March 8th, I think. <laughs> but I'm doing another Stitch Your Library. This is a fun one. This is just a like a fun Stitch Your Library that I've been wanting to make this pattern for a while. And haven't been able to get around to making it. Or I just haven't gone around to making it. I think she's good. <laughs> she's laying on the couch behind me. Um, but it's from this book right here. It's called Hooked on Amigurumi by Melanie, what was it? Melanie Morita. I'll link it below. I'm sure you can get it on Amazon and maybe thrift books. I don't know. I'll try to look around and see if I can find it on there. But it's got all these cute different Amigurumi's food and little characters and stuff. And um, there's a few things in here that I want to make, of course. <laughs> but there's one in particular I've been wanting to make for a while. Are you fussing? No. <laughs> I think she's just talking. But, um, I love Asian food, and mostly because it's super salty, <laughs> and I love saltiness. I'm like, I constantly crave salty things. I love salt. And I love all the chicken that they cook. <laughs> Pretty much anything, I will eat it. So, I've been wanting to make the little soy sauce that was in there, so I finally made it. I started it yesterday, and I finished it this morning. So, here it is. It's so cute. <laughs> it's just a little soy sauce. It's on the cover. I think it's called, it's got a, it's a K word. What's it called? It's called, I guess it's Kiko. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it or not. That's soy sauce. So it's so cute. Look at him. I really should have put the face over here because I actually put it right where that jog is, but oh well, it's not a big deal. So I'm probably gonna put this in my kitchen. This is gonna live somewhere in my kitchen. Cause I absolutely love soy sauce and like Asian food and chicken and rice with like soy sauce and Worcestershire sauce, however you say that, and all that kind of stuff on there. It's just so good. Are you wanting? <laughs> but there he is. He's so cute. You start with down here and you work your way up. And that's it. It's just real simple. Uh, this is Red Heart Super Sever Black, White, and Cherry Red. These are, uh, this is a scrap ball. This is a little, like, half use skein. And this is a big old jumble skein. Because <laughs> I'm out of all my red scrap balls from making my blankets and stuff recently. So I'm having to use, I had to use a big old jumble skein just to use this little bit of red. <laughs> but uh, and I put little safety eyes on there and a little mouth. It's just so cute. It does sit up. So I'm probably going to put it somewhere in my kitchen just because it's cute and funny. And uh, I love him. He's my favorite. <laughs> but yeah, this is the book that it was in. Hooked on Amber Grimmie. I will I will definitely try to link this down below so you can check it out. But that's my um, Stitcher Library number mm, six or seven. I can't remember. Come here. Let me pick you up. I tried putting her in the, um, the wrap. But she got grumpy. Because I was going to cook some meatballs. But I had to wait till later, huh? You want your best fire? There you go. Look at her. <laughs> I'm try, I can't. Can you hold it? Every time I try to pick her up with her pacifier in, she spits it out. And starts crying. There she is. <laughs> Anyways. So, yeah. June is... We went to the doctor yesterday for her one month appointment. It's technically, she was almost six weeks. She'll be six weeks tomorrow. But we're behind on her appointments, just like we're with Jessie's. With scheduling, you know, they're always, Jessie's is a month late. And hers is apparently two weeks late. But that's okay. So she, um, she's doing good, everything. She weighed yesterday nine pounds, eight and a half ounces. So she's gained two pounds and like three ounces. Yeah. And she was 22 and a half inches long. So she's gotten longer and tubbier, which is good. She's still in newborn clothes, which is weird to me because Jesse was in zero to three months when he was born. And when he was born, he was in size one diapers. She is still in newborn diapers. Size ones are too big for her. So it's weird. Like they were similar weights. Like he was nine pounds one. She's nine eight now. But I guess hers is distributed differently than his was. He does have a big butt. But, um, because he was in big, bigger diapers, and she's still newborn diapers. I gotta go buy some more, because we're almost out of newborn diapers. And I tried another one on her today, and it was still too big. So we had to go to the store and get some more little tiny diapers, huh? <laughs> but yeah, she's doing good. She's a growing. I still do plan on doing a birth story, because I know a lot of people are interested in it. I just haven't had time to sit down and talk about it. Can I hold you up here to show you off? You gonna start crying? There you are. <laughs> Say hello. Don't get mad. <laughs> Don't get mad. I'm sorry. Here, you can have this back. I'm sorry. 
I keep trying to vlog also. <laughs> I keep starting vlogs and I never finish them because I get so busy, uh, especially when Jess gets home from school in the evenings. So I'm gonna try to vlog one of these days. I'll probably have to wait till a weekend when Devin's off because then he can help me tag team the kids. <laughs> but uh, she looks like she's gonna fall asleep. Are you sleepy? You just woke up. <laughs> she's like, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so that's my June and my little soy sauce. <laughs> Which I love. I love soy sauce. I love anything salty. I always crave salty stuff. But yeah. So we're going to hop off here and I'm going to see if she wants to take a nap. Are you sleepy? If she takes a nap, I'm going to be making meatballs tonight for dinner. I found a recipe. I left it sitting in the kitchen. <laughs> it's called, um, I think it's called cheddar, barbecue cheddar meatballs. Yeah. I'll link that below too if I can think about it. It was a Pinterest pin, but I can't remember the website. I wasn't even paying attention. I just read the recipe and then I printed it out to try it. <laughs> so, um, I'll, I'll link it below too if you want to check it out. I'm going to try making those tonight. I think they'll be good. Uh, and probably some mashed potatoes on the side. I think that'd be good. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so that's what we're going to have for dinner tonight. Uh, I also thought about trying to make some cheese sticks. I found a recipe the other day for some, like, their knockoff, um, Papa John's you know cheese sticks it's basically like a cheese pizza that's cut into stick shapes <laughs> is how they do theirs jesse loves those so i wanted to try to make some of those for him uh, and it just makes a, it uses a um a tube of you know like pre-done pizza dough the one that i bought at walmart was um great values brand i believe uh and then you just put the toppings on top of it you know and bake it and i was going to try to make those tonight for jesse because he might not like the cheese balls with barbecue sauce on them cheese balls meatballs whatever he might eat them though he's getting a little bit better at eating trying different things but he loves uh pizza i like most kids <laughs> and um cheese sticks especially like when, usually when we if we order out pizza he prefers to eat cheese sticks mostly he'll um so i always order like a a big order of cheese sticks because i know that's what he's gonna eat <laughs> and um but yeah so i'm gonna try to make some of those if i have time if baby lays down <laughs> if not i have to wait till Devin wakes up in a little bit and then he can take her and i can go in there and cook <laughs> but the meat meatballs shouldn't take long because they're going to be little and meatballs cook pretty fast anyways and i imagine the cheese sticks will take long either so but yeah so that is my stitch library number something <laughs> and also a light little life update <laughs> but i'm gonna hop off here and try to get this edited and up i meant to make a video yesterday and the day before that and i didn't have a chance so that's okay I'll pop up every now and then, I guess, <laughs> as I can, until she gets a little bit older and can be, um, like, set on a play mat or something. She still doesn't pay attention. I got the one that we got from our um, registry. I got it out and put it together. It's in the floor. <laughs> but she doesn't, like, pay attention to it yet. She's still too little. Um, so, I know, I usually, it's, like, three plus months where they can actually, like, see the things hanging in front of them and reach for them. So, it's still a little while. She'll be six weeks tomorrow. So... She's got some growing to do before she can distract herself a little bit. <laughs> but, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to hop off here, and I'll see you guys in another video tomorrow. I will see you and watch your work on Wednesday. I already got my pattern ready for it. I'm just waiting for Devin to get up so I can get the yarn because <laughs> it's in the bedroom, and I don't want to bug him until he's awake because he has to work. But um, I'm going to get that started today so that I can show it to you guys tomorrow. I'm excited about it. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.